Hey, welcome to this Cold Waters gameplay video. If you love Cold Waters, then don't miss a minute of what's coming up. Hey, welcome. It's time to play some Cold Waters and the Epic Mod. Well, I have been playing this a lot and I'm really frustrated can't seem to get off go um, can't live long enough to develop new tactics how's that so it passed my mind finally this morning I got these settings on elite what do you say we dumb it down a little bit to merely realistic and see how things go I think that might be smart. At least it'd give me a chance to uh, to learn some things. Maybe I'll live long enough to complete a mission or two. So that's uh, that's how we're going to play this today. And this is really funny the way it behaves because it it uh, nothing like a mod. It changes the behavior of the video. Everything. <laughs> that's okay. I think it's still recording the uh, the webcam. And we can fix that by uh, playing a little video trick here in a minute. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to get it here today. We're going to play. We're going to start a campaign. We're going to do the uh, global map NATO. We're going to start her up. We're going to take the best possible submarine for NATO. So I'll have a better chance to survive. And that's kind of a tough call, quite honestly. Um, Sea Wolf has got a lot of tubes and a lot of wires, and that's nice. And she's got a big loadout, which is even more important than it used to be. Interestingly enough, I don't see her, I don't see the uh, self noise rating. We also have the uh, Flight 3. Los Angeles class, which is cool. She's actually faster. She's got about half the weapons and four wires only. <sighs> we're going to go ahead and go with Seawolf, and mostly because I think we're going to just, we need all the help we can get to survive long enough to learn some new tactics. What do you say we do it that way? So, let's accept it. We've got the Seawolf. But before I do that, I'm going to put a quick cut in the video so I can fix a problem here. It's really hard to monitor how well this webcam is performing if I can't see it. So back in just a moment there. Hopefully that was not noticeable to you. Oh, yeah, one more thing. Now that I'm back. It's a YouTube ritual. If you've enjoyed these videos, you find them interesting. If you think you're learning something, if you think it's worth your time, then please consider subscribing, liking, sharing, and commenting. That's what feeds the algorithm. That's what helps the channel to grow. And uh, I really appreciate it. Finally, if you really want to uh, make a big deal out of this, you can buy me a cup of coffee. There's a link in the description. Let's get this going. Let's start playing these training scenarios, trying to learn how to survive this. Okay, we've got all this stuff. Uh, just between us girls, the uh, localization is kind of weird. And uh, there's, some, there's some issues. Uh, don't get me wrong. Whoever did this is doing better on a Russian to English translation than I would ever do on an English to Russian translation. So I'm not judging. <laughs> Just saying, when you read this stuff, sometimes you go, huh? And people do this for love, not for money. Uh, you, you don't want to dump on them. Um, that's awkward. And. So this scenario is NATO's attacking a weakened Russia. That's the way I understand it. First mission. Oh, and by the way, I'm more. I keep. There's so many things to say. No music. I think I said this in the last video. Um, the modders are using some copyrighted music, and YouTube's head explodes, and then they send me all kinds of stuff and they tell me all about it, and I'm going. I don't know. Uh, it, it's not really a big deal. 
it's not like I got a copyright strike but whenever I run into this issue I try to eliminate it to the point of I won't do a game if I can't cut out anything that might cause that problem with one exception and that's uh, uh, you know uh, Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts has some copyrighted stuff but they know it and they tell you how to fix it and you can but even then I turn the video off I mean, the music off because every time I post an Ultimate Admiral Dreadnought video I want to go through the whole oh you've got a copyright claim no I don't oh yeah you're okay it's just let YouTube do its thing we're gonna do our thing we won't have any video or audio or music actually we're gonna have video and audio without the music for God's sakes I need a cup of coffee all right, intelligence detected loading of torpedoes and other cargoes and supply ships in Port Petropavlovsk, Kamchatsky. Hmm, that's Northern Pacific. Suggested the supply convoy will leave areas south coast of Africa. Like I said, that guy did a better job of Russian to English than I would do of English to Russian. But still, it's weird. You are ordered to find and send this convoy until the opponent receives reinforcement. You may also be given a chance to meet opponent submarines. Okay. <laughs> it's it's the equivalent of Cold Waters, uh, uh, the movie Borat, right? <laughs> oh, okay. Um, well, if we start in the Atlantic, I have played enough. The Suez Canal exists, so we may have to run that way. Uh, south coast of Africa. Huh, we'll have to see. Now this is a big deal. I don't like the default lay, uh, loadout. Who's going to take 12 Mark 48s? So um, we're going to cut that back to, I don't know, 6. Uh, we're going to cut that back to 6. We're going to just accept the fact, well, Put that back to six. What does that give us? Twenty. <clears throat> I'm really tempted to get rid of the T lambs, and uh, if they give us a mission, we just go. We had to go back and get some more. But let's go ahead and go. We'll go with uh, with oh. Uh, uh, I'm tempted to ditch all the harpoons and take nothing but uh, uh, tomahawks. Actually, though, there's a difference you can launch. I think tomahawks can be launched. One of them can be launched deeper than the other, and I don't recall. I think maybe the tomahawks are launched at 50 feet. Harpoons might be able to launch a little deeper. Let's leave it alone. Let's go play. Too much talk. But remember, this isn't your normal, uh, or at least not my normal, uh, cold waters video this is a tutorial and I'm the student and you guys are just watching me trying to learn let's go all right there we are uh, south part of Africa that's probably them right there so we're just gonna run straight across the uh, the Atlantic into the South Atlantic because I think we can beat them to the Indian Ocean I hope. One thing about this uh, global map, there's a lot of transit time. A lot. And we are moving really fast. That's a really speedy transit. There's still November 2nd, and I'm just cutting across the Atlantic. So I'm not sure that they have scaled the time. I'm not sure at all that they've scaled the time with the distance you're moving now that we've got this new map. Um, hmm, that's interesting. It's still November 2nd, and I've gone. So, yeah, clearly, clearly, this is nonsense. But it doesn't affect anything. That looks like them right there. And it looks like they've got somebody ahead of them screening. So, the Indian Ocean. As I understand it, it's kind of a nasty place for. Uh, I don't like that. Don't like that maritime patrol aircraft coming this way. Kind of a nasty place. Uh, I don't know where I read that it's noisy and it's uh, difficult for submarines. Of course, that could be all nonsense. 
I'm actually trying to fill in for the lack of music. Okay, let's sit still for a minute because I don't want to get caught by that. There they are. I don't want to get caught by that surface group that's trying to screen these guys. Oh, 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 no, 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 stop. Uh, brief, brief. One thing I didn't do before we get in the fight, we don't want to change this then. Um, let's go with torpedoes and defenses because we have no idea what we're heading into and, tor and really enemy torpedoes are grim. Alright here we are I think we hold real still okay in vanilla cold waters right now I say we've got them <laughs> in an epic mod it could just be they've got us now again I've dialed the difficulty down Let's see what happens. All right. I could have done that here. I forgot. I panicked. Um, I don't know if this works. We're at 60 feet. Headings are 3.8. Speed's 5 knots. Everything looks good. Let's just get in there. On separate ship for ultra quiet. 88 dB. That's about the noisiest I've heard it. Console I've seen it in this game. Bearing. Zero. Six. Six. Designated Sierra Two. Hell, Sierra Con, Two. Sonar, new contact bearing. Zero. I six, might can six, make six, out Sierra One. Sierra three. Con, sonar, new contact bearing. Zero. Six. Six. One designated thing I wish they had not four. done, and that is play with the uh, waterfall display. It's a Grisha. Boy, they show up a lot. On sonar, Sierra One is classified as escort. Yeah, Grisha show up a bunch. And I've had them, if you've seen the video, I've had a Grisha beat me like a redheaded stepchild, so we're going to take sonar, her very seriously. Three is classified as merchant. Sonar Sierra Four is classified as merchant. Con Sonar Sierra Four is classified as merchant. Yeah, I was trying to classify Sierra Two, which I think is a merchant Con sonar, also. Sierra Holy crap! We've got a torpedo merchant. in the water already. One point seven k yards away. Left two. Is there a helicopter Three, up there? No, That's got to be what found us. That's got to be it. Somebody. 10,000 yards, 066. Six. Now I might new contact bearing. Zero, ought to seven, be. Four. Designated Sierra 5. It's, uh, you know what? We're too, we're too deep. Make that, four, five, eight, die, five. that guy has found us already. Fortunately, those torpedoes don't seem to be. Up to go. There he is, right there. Contact bearing zero five nine. Whoa. Down scope. All right, we need to get some water over the hatch. Make I think I've already zero, taken too many zero, chances eight, getting nine, that up. We got some ranges. Here's what I think I have learned. One, we're about to get hammered. Steady course. I don't believe these guys. How did they know where we were so fast? 
He's right behind us while I'm trying to get down a little deeper. There he is right back there, I think. Passing 200 feet. Now somebody did suggest that, and I should have looked this up, somebody suggested that I was not getting any no, I'm getting towed array. There was this comment that said, hey, maybe you have to deploy your towed array, but I see my towed array. So we're going to skunk. Oh, it's a Savremni out there. God. Look at that big boy. I'm really trying to figure out. A... He's right behind us. And we are skulking away. Heck, I'm reluctant to use the rudder right now. Yeah, he didn't put a torpedo in the water. Long range attacks look to me to be very difficult to pull off. What was kind of interesting about that though is that I don't remember seeing that. I may have Helm seen that soft remedy. I think zero, maybe two, raising the mast and getting eyes on is now identifying things. Which is, would be pretty awesome. How much water do I have? All I can use. All right, how are these guys behaving? I said, Cretia is closing pretty briskly. Yeah, I think it's really going to take some deliberate play, and I don't know what to make of that. I feel okay about those. Yeah, okay, clearly. Clearly. All right, pilot, here's the thing. This is not your daddy's cold waters. And shoot, shoot, get you dead, dead. So we're going to take it real slow and easy today. We're going to sneak around just like we're a real submariner. 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 I need somebody to correct me on that. And we got six weapons. I really think I ought to be deeper. I have this thing about being deep. Looks like one helicopter. And we may have given him the slip. Helm, steady course. I don't know what they heard, because I don't think I put that. I did not. I did not put that periscope up before those torpedoes fell. So that's. Uh, Here's what's happening. These guys are heading toward me. I seem to be right in front of them. And that guy was, boom, there they are blowing up. That guy was screening the convoy. And he got a sniff of us and dropped those weapons. Yeah, that's his ticket. That's the story. I'm sticking to that story. Now I start imagining tactics. Should I do something crazy, like cut one of these guys loose off in some oddball direction just to make the escorts crazy? Will the launch trans draw them to me if I do that? I'm going to assume for right now that that isn't smart. 
Yeah, we are in ultra quiet. Okay. And we are waiting, 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 waiting. I'm bow on to them, trying to minimize the my aspect to their active sonar. Probably ought to come a little bit right. Zero eight one helm I. Problem is that these goobers actually have sonar. Now that's challenging. It's not very good sonar, but they have it. He does too. Really, the Grisha right now is the guy who's threatening us. He's at 6,000 yards. Uh. All right. I'm getting antsy. What would be awesome is for this guy to go past us and for us to get some shots at these guys at reasonable ranges, which we are almost in now. What we can't do in this mod is depend on, one, fast torpedoes, because it looks to me like, oh my god, it looks to me like they have slowed the Mark 48 down. I think it's a 40 knot torpedo. Now, I haven't confirmed that by looking in vanilla cold waters to see if my suspicion is true, but they do seem to take forever to get anywhere. And that's also going to be really challenging against a uh, an alpha. It's like, hey, you know what? It's an alpha. Ha ha. Mark 48s. Good luck with that. What? What? Con sonar Sierra Seven is classified as submerged submarine. Um. An escorting submarine doesn't shock me. An escorting typhoon is insane. Um, okay, this guy is farting around. We don't know where this guy is, but he may be very, very close. And he may know that we are here. What? <laughs> um... I'm lost for words. Um, I need to swallow something wet. Swallow something dry would be awkward. <sighs> yeah. Right now, thinking I've got to deal with a typhoon as well as a convoy. When I saw a typhoon take a substantial portion of my entire weapons loadout last time I ran into one. What? <laughs> yeah, uh, boys, the RNG is insane. I mean, that should just be X'd out. That should just be, yeah, you, you know, you can't do that. It can't happen. Uh, that just threw, I think Master 5 is the one that's active, not the submarine. Another Sovereignty. Sonar, Master 5 is classified as escort. Okay, um... That deserves a screenshot to be posted at the Computer War Games forum at, at Facebook. Hey guys! <laughs> Two Sovereignties. Two Sovereignties. A Typhoon. A Grisha. To escort a Don and two Ugras. Um, 
It's a beta. It's a beta. <laughs> Please don't take any of this to mean any, any kind of. Uh, 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 okay, yeah, criticism is legitimate. All right, it's not to me. It, I don't mean any of this to mean any kind of uh, uh, ugly. You know, I'm not. I'm not trying to be critical for the sake of being critical. But if I have identified this right, this is silly. Heck of a challenge, though. Huh? Heck of a challenge. <laughs> uh and that baby is on the same level as we are, 2,500 yards away, and I don't believe that. He could be right on top of us. And the bad thing is, is if we decided to take him, we would have to flush almost every weapon we have to have a chance. Yeah, he's really listening. Six knots. Him too. These guys are making 13. And I could probably put weapons out there now that they couldn't avoid. In fact, I might end up with fratricide, uh, not being, having weapons hammering two different targets. This has really gotten more difficult. Whole nother game, guys. I mean, this is real slow. We're dialing a little bit of rudder. I want to see if I can improve my solution on what I think is a typhoon by swinging my bow. I've only got six weapons queued up. I've got seven targets that typhoon is resolving. I'd like to see him. And then I'd like to hope that the beta still has the uh, AI doesn't enable inside of 5,000 yards trick. But this is just about impossible right now. I don't see a way. 24 minutes in, I haven't put the first weapon in the water. If you've watched any of my videos, you, even, even, even in my slowest play days in vanilla cold waters, I'd, I'd already, we'd already finished one mission, be on the second one. And right now, we are just sitting here, being very quiet and very patient, doing the cold waters thing. Uh, no. I'm gonna ballast down a little bit, start sinking this thing out. Should have done this already. I don't know if that's any quieter than uh, planes, but I'm paranoid at this point. Passing 400 feet. A typhoon. A typhoon. Who puts a strategic asset, something that ought to be hiding in the Arctic, as an escort? i got to get a visual on it, because that'll confirm that we almost have it. That'll confirm it. I don't think it will show us the wrong model. It did not. Well... Okay, let's just accept something here. We're dead. This guy will kill us. We cannot put Passing 600 feet. enough weapons in the water to hurt him before he gets us or somebody else up there gets us. A typhoon. Alright, well, here's what we're going to do. Come left to. 
I don't know why this guy has not lit up on us because he has he's bound to know somebody's here he's just bound to he's uh oh he just went active Right. From Sierra Seven. Shoot two seven. Aye, sir. Con helm, steady course. Con sonar, torpedo in the water. Torpedo in the water. Bearing one one seven. Shoot two six. Aye, sir. Shoot two two. Con fire control, weapon acquired. Con fire control, weapon acquired. Shoot two eight. Aye, sir. All right. Sonar, Sierra, seven is cavitating. Go. Make turns for three, five knots. Maneuvering eye. Con sonar, noise flooding in the reactor. And we're done. I just didn't get moving fast enough. And we're done. All right, this really puts me in an odd place. Do I build, do I actually publish this freaking video? <laughs> Do I? Uh, what the hell is this? Oh. Screenshot. Yeah, we're going to step through this nonsense. That was just complete and utter nonsense. Now, I say that. That's interesting. What? You're kidding me. You know what it just did? It just took that submarine out of the mix. Wow. Okay, so we're not playing Iron Man. We're still in the same campaign. And it just took... Let's check this. This is... We'll start it again. No, back. I think I clicked the wrong thing. I must have clicked the... Uh, yeah, I did. I clicked... Uh, I'm so shook up about... Alright, I have never completed my thought there. Um... I never completed my thought. The typhoon's out of place. Bad out of place. So you go, oh, it was just wrong. Well, the same thing would have happened if it had been an Alpha or a Victor. Heck, same thing might have happened if it had been a Foxtrot, but I think we'd have heard the Foxtrot long before it was right on top of us. Uh, the other interesting thing is inside of 2,000 yards, he hammered us with a torpedo. And in vanilla, that would have been perfectly safe. So, yeah, I don't like two soft remedies and a bloody typhoon in the mix escorting three lousy merchies. But given the situation, if it had been a more reasonable escort, it still would have been deadly. Now, I have to admit, if it had been, uh, let's say, a victor, I'd have probably been willing to, early on, flush a lot of weapons, sending two of the victors away, and hoping I could evade and get the first lick in. Because two ought to do the victor. I was totally overwhelmed with the idea of a, higher, of a typhoon, because I only had six torpedoes. And last time I faced one of those things, it took seven. Seven to put her down. So, this is an interesting video today, boys and girls. Doubt there are any girls involved. Boys and those who identify as a girl. Okay, I shouldn't go there. 
Let's try it again. We've only got 30 minutes in, give or take a little. I think I clicked on the right thing, but if I click on that, it changed something. What's interesting is that you don't have a 2002 North Atlantic. Hmm. Okay. Let's see if I'm right. Let's see if the the Sea Wolf is in the mix now. So it looks like it said, you know, what, 2002 SSM 21 existed. You just lost her. She's done. If you're going to continue the campaign, start with something else. Hmm. Actually, that's pretty cool. I wonder if they do the same thing because I'm not sure how many sovereignties existed, but it wasn't dozens. I'd have to go look. Something I didn't think I had to research before I came to play a game of Cold Waters. But you see my point. Okay, all right. Look, I'm just I'm. It's not interesting to 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 do what I'm doing. Well, I hope it's. I hope it is interesting. But I'm, you know, you're hearing me trying to think my way through. And once again, that little screen flash and my freaking it screws up the video. I think it's still there. I don't care. I don't care. Uh, loading of torpedoes, spy ships. I just want to leave areas. Leave area. All right. Shanghai going to it's the same thing only different except the Russian English is slightly more confusing all right we're going to do the same thing again we're going to ditch a bunch of this stuff We're going to take more of this stuff. We're getting rid of these entirely. Just don't care. I'm sitting here acting like I'm acting like I expect to survive the campaign long enough for any of that nonsense to matter. <laughs> and I think that's a uh, not a reasonable expectation. Okay, off to Madagascar once again. That was on normal or realistic difficulty. All right, there they are right there. So we're going to the same thing. And I have to wonder if we're not going to run into the same escort. And that this will be a very interesting, if unusual, cold waters video. But it really is turning into an analysis of the mod. Yeah, look at those guys. They got the same thing. They got a screen. And we can sit here. Well, why sit here? Let's run out. We'll stay in these high southern latitudes. Wow. They got to give them this. This is like, yep, we've got hunter killers that are serious about screening. that guy all right the surface guys went that way the submarines are between us and them the submarine sniffed us Something has. Satellite recon. Something. Question is, where are the surface ships?
NATO forces won Ukraine. Yeah, yeah, right. Something NATO forces always wanted to do. But it is interesting to see it from the point of view of somebody on the other side of the line. Okay, what did I say last time? They've got us now. <laughs> All right, okay, I'm loaded out with this, which I don't want. And I got a bunch of torpedoes, which I do want. I'm tempted to throw some harpoons in the mix just to uh, see if I can pop one of the uh, torpedoes are the most flexible weapon I have. Let's go. On rig ship for ultra quiet. Relatively noisy. Con sonar new contact bearing zero nine seven designated. Sierra nice and deep. Two. Con sonar new contact bearing zero nine three designated Sierra three. Ariga. Con sonar new contact bearing zero six six designated Sierra four. What is that? Con Don sonar, Sierra two is classified as merchant. Con sonar new contact bearing zero eight seven designated Sierra five. That be a submarine. Con sonar new contact bearing zero nine five designated Sierra six. We just don't know what the heck that is. And normally I'm not so careful about my language, but it's a family friendly channel. Although I can't imagine anybody other than gaming lunatics are watching. That's another Don. Yeah, I think so. And for some reason it reset my Con Sonar Sierra Six is classified as emergent. No. Probably a Don. Con Sonar Sierra Three is classified as merchant. There's just no calling that one. <sighs> Frustrating. Sierra 5, I don't know. Make depth four, five, eight, we'll take a chance, huh? Sierra 4 is a 064. I think that is, is classified as merchant. Yeah, that is not a target. New ESM contact bearing zero eight seven. Well, oh, can't get a target on. I can't get a. I think that's the Riga. No? I cannot get a range on him. He's at. Yeah. Contact lost. Bearing 088. Yes, yes, yes. The, the other guys are. Down to 200 feet. Make depth two, zero, zero feet dive, dive. Let's hope that nothing comes flying out of the sky on us while we head south. 
Con, sonar, lost contact. Master, five. Last bearing, zero. Con, dive at two, zero, zero feet, dive by. They're a long ways off. Con, sonar, lost contact. Master, six. Last bearing, zero, nine. So six. we don't even know. There's contact a pause. Made it. Come right to. We don't even zero, know. Zero. Helm, I. Con, helm, steady course. If there are other escorts, probably are, and they're over the horizon. Perhaps what I should have done. Is load up some harpoons and try to hit those guys from distance. Huh? Nothing's stopping us. Except my own inability to click on things. Con, torpedo room, tube two ready. At Riga. Just make Calm. may make life complicated before we can pull this off. Con torpedo room tube seven ready. Con sonar regained contact on master two bearing zero nine five. All right, the Riga is at nineteen thousand yards. Come left two. One, seven, nine, seven, Fortunately, five. he's rather deaf. Of course, so are we right no. now. Steady course. Us being under the lair and all. Let's come back up. And see if the change there gets us. A, if we can get back on some contacts. Con, dive at yeah. Four, five, eight, dive Don at 24,000. That's solid. Con, sonar regained contact on. Master, six. Bearing, zero, nine, four. Con, sonar regained contact on. Master, five. Bearing Master, left, five is pinging eight, away. Eight, eight. Helm, I. I'm gonna guess he's a Grisha. Master five is classified as escort. Con helm, steady course. And what is Master Seven? We don't know. Taking a lot of chances doing this time compression thing. They have Call altered course two, in a big three, way. Three, nine, helm, I. Con, helm, steady course. Oh! Con sonar, master three is classified as merchant. Sierra eight. Stinks of submarine. But An oil rig? Con sonar Sierra 8 is classified as. I'm not sure that the uh, webcam is working, but I should have a quite a, a puzzled look right now. Puzzled. All right, I'm getting. I, 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 I'm absolutely taken by this whole thing. Um, right. Another... Let's go. 
periscope observation, it may be unwise. Once again, we see that guy. And we can't get a... I can't range him. This is probably not smart, but you know, what are you going to do? Raise the radar mast. Con sonar, master seven is classified as escort. Shoot two seven, aye sir. Shoot two two, aye sir. Shoot two three, aye sir. All right. We need some Shoot two five. Hi, sir. wasted weapons. And we need to get out of here. Con sonar, we are cavitating. All right, how are we doing? Con sonar lost contact. Master eight passing one hundred feet. Con sonar lost contact. Mast passing 200 feet. Be down to a thousand feet. Con sonar lost contact. Master one. Last bearing zero nine one. Contact faded. Con sonar no longer cavitating. This could be the only way that this made any sense. If they've got any aircraft, we're in trouble. And those torpedoes were just kind of thrown out there, you know. And under old rules, I would say, oh, wow, we're getting these days. That was forever. Lost contact. Well, one of them one. got it. Last bearing, zero, nine, two, contact breaking up. There's another one. All right, here comes some payback. I didn't do that. That is a sub launch, so there is a submarine out there. Come left to three, three, five, helm I. Here he comes. Go deeper. Make depth one two zero zero feet. Die by. Now, how does this guy behave? The uh, American dumps a, the American equivalent dumps a uh, parachute, drops in vertically. We are skidding away from that launch location just as fast as we can. Okay, so it's the same drill. Makes sense, and we should see it where it hits. Okay, it's way behind us. Hopefully, hopefully, seriously behind us. I don't know if we got everybody we needed to get. I really don't. Alright, those are our torpedoes. They've got a heavy weight torpedo in the water. I have no idea where it came from. Or do I know where it is? <sighs> we get quiet. Maybe we can start sniffing these guys out again. Con, helm, steady course. Con sonar regained contact on master two bearing one zero six. 
Well, they're dropping lightweight torpedoes all over the place there. We don't hear... This is just taking forever, isn't it? This is going to be really challenging. We don't know where that is. We haven't heard it. Those are almost certainly wasted shots for us. They were just all that I mean, they were over the horizon. I don't have a lot of confidence in them. Got two of them. Okay. Here we go. Contact on master six bearing zero. Got to get above that seven. layer to really figure out where Consonar everybody is. Regained contact on master five bearing zero eight six. I need to load some tubes here. Con torpedo room two. Con sonar regained contact on master four bearing zero one eight. We got that guy locked up. Get these tubes loaded. Con, torpedo room, tube five ready. Con, dive at four, five, eight, dive by. Well, here we go again. Raise the radar mast. New radar contact, bearing one, zero, one. Aye, sir. Shoot two seven. Aye, sir. Shoot two five. Aye, sir. Contact lost. Down. Bearing zero nine seven. Contact. Dive. We are cavitating. New radar contact. Bearing one zero zero. We don't have a radar up anymore, babe. It's contact. just not. It's not a thing anymore. I lowered the freaking lower radar mass. It's doing the same nonsense. I hit. It didn't change that behavior. I lowered the mass. It hadn't quite gotten all the way down. I hit the deep dive or emergency deep, and it raised it. What are you going to do, huh? Passing 600 feet. I heard it defending. Oh, we got the Grisha. Somebody's trying to stop him. Got him. He got him. Well, this is turning into interesting. No, don't do that. Turning into a pure missile attack. On, Knocking off. Been repaired. Morons. <laughs> uh, well, we've raised hell with the uh, with the convoy. It looks like we still have one of them to get. We've bumped off one Grisha. Don't know. Con sonar Sierra one zero is classified as submerged. Sub oh, I think one of our torpedoes. I think one of our long range reach out there. Yeah. What? There's a freaking typhoon. Typhoon. <sighs> yep. 
Yep. And he is done, gone, One, active. Room, two, three, ready. Shoot two one, aye sir. Shoot two six, aye sir. See if we get an off-bearing attack going for him. Very shallow Console, torpedoes. Maker, bearing, zero, nine, nine. I think we got one of those first dive, Hail one, Mary one, shots. Five, zero, eight, dive, I. I think worked out for us. <sighs> Freaking radar Always mask radar is up. Mask. God help me. I do not understand this game. <laughs> it's another game. How far away is that torpedo? All right, unless they've done something magic with those torpedoes, that guy can't hear us. This guy's dumping. Has he got a problem? Did that torpedo I oh, sent his way? Tube five ready. Is he being chased by that other? Con sonar lost contact. Sierra. One, I don't think zero, so. Those are two. Bearing. Yeah, we got those two, the only two out there. Shoot tube eight. Aye, sir. Let's get some tube shooting. Isn't that right? If you're watching this pilot, I don't know if this is your cup of tea. I don't even know if it's my cup of tea. But it clearly is another thing. Make depth eight zero zero feet dive by. That Don is way out there. If we can get him, if we can get shallow. Get crazy. Con sonar, switching to active search. I think we're too far away to pick up that typhoon. Con sonar, switching to passive search. Alright, we're taking some wild shots at the uh, Typhoon. We may lose the wire, that's why I... That's why I sent these guys with a little bit of a spread here. But I want that other Don. So let's head up. Got to watch that torpedo that's coming in on us. We just happen to be getting shallow. And that guy. Hopefully. Sonar regained contact on Master 8, bearing 1, 0, 0. Hopefully. Oh, 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 look at this. Tough decision. Got to cut between them. Right to one zero seven helm I. I want that guy to draw that guy off. I just don't want to get out in front of them. And I'm coming up shallow enough now that I should be able to.
They're on narrow. Got to be careful how I aim. Shoot two five. Aye, sir. Shoot two three. Aye, sir. A lot of guys in the. A lot of things happening here. This is going to be a long video. So we ran into another convoy escorted by a freaking typhoon. Yeah, that's just weird. Looks like that guy has got his attention, which is healthy for us. That means I can turn away from this mess up there hopefully we will continue following that and I can reload that tube reload that tube and reload that tube and these things have a long way to go looks like our target right there though so any second now, they ought to start behaving like they're attacking something, right? Right? Yeah, there it goes. It's going into its terminal. Oh, the other one got it. Whoa, are you doing wire guided here? Look at this circling around nonsense. Don't know what Sierra 9 was. Con sonar, switching to active search. Con helm, steady core. Still have a wire. Make depth one zero zero eight die by. Let's get below the dead layer and see if that helps us ping that typhoon. Okay, what's saved our butts so far? It's pretty simple. They don't have any air assets. Without that, fire control, we've lost the con sonar regain contact on Sierra one zero bearing one zero zero. Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. We kind of got a sniff on that typhoon. I'm going to send that guy active. And hope. Okay, that torpedo's got to come down. Got to come down below the layer. That's better. Know if that'll help. Other than maybe to bring some more death from above on us. Doesn't seem to be helping. Let's turn it off. seems to be running away, but I think we've got a good fix on him. Well, we did. Con 
on sonar. Noisemaker bearing one. Zero. It's got him excited. Don't know where he is. Got to keep hunting out here for him. Uh, yeah. We've got a bearing, and that's it. I don't think he's behind us, but we'll look. Yeah, you just come up to the surface, pal. Ooh, we got him now. We've got a good 83%. Load one of those up for me. Con sonar lost contact. Master four. Last bearing zero, zero, two. Contact faded. I don't think we can kill this guy, and this is just eating up video time like mad. Con sonar, switching to active search. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing one, zero, seven. Likes using depth. This is somewhat of a nightmare here. <laughs> Got this torpedo's active sonar doing its thing. Big pause. Torpedo room, tube six ready. Look at that, there's a noisemaker. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing one, zero, eight. Yeah, it's, uh, I think these Mark 48s have been dumbed down something ferocious. We are in the vicinity, this guy, and yet we cannot Find Noisemaker bearing one zero nine. Uh, we may have to cut a bunch of this out of the video. I may just have to edit this no end. He's here and he's close. And this torpedo can't find him. And I'm calling nonsense. I just don't believe it. Not given the performance I've seen on the Russian torpedoes on Elite. They're lightweight torpedoes. Just come screaming at you. This guy is climbing, diving. He's doing everything he can do. He is very close in here. That's our decoy. And it's not like we're being fooled by the decoys. We're just not finding him. Sonar, noise 
Peacemaker bearing one, zero, six. Come on now, how hard can it be? You've got a, got a submarine the size of a city block and this torpedo with its active sonar. Well, what if we turn that off? Well, noisemaker bearing one zero. Well, six. well, remember these ranges are not for sure. Guns are switching the passive search. This is hopeless. There's the noisemaker. That submarine is right here. He is somewhere right here. And yet, this torpedo cannot touch him. Up! Uh. We've actually got a very good look at him right now. There he is. And now he's gone. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing one zero five. Um, I'm calling bullshit. <laughs> this torpedo, this, this submarine, this boomer the size of the world is dancing like an alpha. Can't be found by a torpedo that's very close in. Oh... Torpedoes going in the wrong direction. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing one zero five. And my wire is just weird. That torpedo just decided to go up for its own reasons. There he is. I think we've actually got a visual. Now that's something on the bottom. I don't have a visual at all. I'm looking at a wreck. I'm looking at the wreck of the dawn. <sighs> well. Con sonar, switching the passive search. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing. One, zero. This torpedo is about run itself out. Shoot two five. 
Aye, sir. This torpedo has just about run itself out. Shoot tube two. Aye, sir. Down to a minute runtime, it can't find anything. Sonar, noisemaker bearing one zero seven. Well, we're probably running an hour and a half now. This has been a successful mission. I may edit the entire first half of the video out. I don't know. All I know is we can't touch this guy. Make depth three, zero, zero, eight, die by. And more and more, I said this in the I said this in the forum today. I, 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 I yeah, that's the end of the torpedo. Guys, these Mark 48s have been dumbed down something fierce. All right, we've got active sonar going against something that's about 17,000 yards away. Well, Come left we don't two, know. One, zero, seven, helm, I. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra, one. Zero. Yeah, Bearing it's the one, magic typhoon. Zero, six. Contact faded. Con sonar switching to active search. Yep, I don't know. I don't know. Con dive at three zero zero feet. Dive by. Con helm steady course. I have to do the time compression thing just to try to get somewhere. Because the Mark 48s are really slow. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra 1 0, bearing 1 0 4. Yeah, the Mark 48s are just. Not even practically quick anymore. I guess anything other than a surface target, any fast submerged target is going to get them to hell. And that is a fast submerged target. Gone fire control, we've lost the wire. Well, that did it for him. Con, torpedo room, tube five ready. We don't know where he is. What? You mean you actually found him? Did I have a defective torpedo? Because I think both of them are on him now. On sonar, noisemaker bearing zero nine four. All right, the torpedo's guiding. It's going up and down.
Con sonar, noisemaker bearing zero nine five. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing zero nine six. Well, I think we must have got a hit because I no longer can see this torpedo. The other torpedo. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing zero nine eight. All right, there's two good hits. Where am I? <laughs> Con sonar lost contact. Sierra one zero. Last bearing <sighs> zero, nine eight. Contact faded. Well, he's probably dived, which means that shot does not going to mean anything. Lordy, 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 lordy. Come on, drop on him. Con, torpedo room, tube two ready. He's not here anymore, it won't matter. Even trying to anticipate him. Come left to zero. We're going to lose that wire because I'm trying to close with this clown. Maneuvering, making turns for one, zero, knots. Uh, you know, it just doesn't matter. Maneuvering eye. I don't think that was another hit. Con, maneuvering, making turns for five, knots. I think that was another exploded torpedo ran out because I had the F9 thing happening. Regained contact on Sierra one zero bearing zero nine six. Yeah, I don't think that's him, or at least I don't think that's where he is. Looks like he's still making 28 knots. It's the classic, you got tarpoons. You got hit twice. Our sonar can't pick him up. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing zero, eight, eight. Come left to zero, six, four, helm, I. He's on the surface? What? Make depth four, five, eight, die, bye. Oh, I've got you now. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing zero eight eight. Con helm, steady course. We did hammer him hard Con enough. Control, weapon acquired. To get his attention, he's Con on sonar, the surface. Noisemaker, bearing zero eight seven. Here's for hoping this torpedo does not kill him. Because now, raise the radar mast. We know where he is. Shoot two three, I sir. Shoot two seven, I sir. Lower the radar mast. Okay, Torpedo, you got 10 minutes of runtime left. I want you going somewhere else because I want these bloody. I want these.
bad boys right here. There is an oil rig. That's ridiculous. <laughs> There's an oil rig. There he is. There he is. Come on. Come on. Enable. Are we going to miss because we have... No, there it is. There it is. Con sonar lost contact. Master 1, 0. Last bearing, 0, 8, 6. Contact. You know what that means? We kill the typhoon with a Tomatalk anti-ship missile. We'll go kill an oil rig. <sighs> Let me out of here. Um, that's a screenshot. Excellent effort! And a silver star. And a bunch of stuff. And I'm not even going to read that. I'm just not going to. You know, I'm going to hit this. I don't want to save this thing. I don't sit back and think about it. If you're watching this, I don't know whether you've watched the better part of two hours of video or whether I've cut 30, 40 minutes out. I kind of think that's what I'm going to do. The first mission was a complete disaster. Um, if I cut it out, then it was running into the same kind of convoy as this, except it had two soft remedies and a typhoon. The typhoon was right on top of me, and it killed me. So I think I'm going to edit that out. I'm going to, it's going to take a little bit of work to edit this all together, and I'll throw some. By now, if you've watched it this long and I've done what I said we're going to do, you already know this. What do I think? I'm not at all certain that this is even playable. <laughs> it's not a game anymore. It's an attempt at a sim and inside of a game skin, and... I'm reluctant to say this, but I said it publicly already on Facebook, so I'm going to say it again. I kind of get the feeling this is the Russian revenge of Cold Waters, because let's face it, Cold Waters Vanilla is kind of a NATO, uh, dare I say it, wet dream. This looks like a Russian wet dream to me. They've got... And, and I don't know if I, I haven't. You haven't seen all this. I've seen their lightweight torpedoes outperform the lightweight torpedoes on the Sea Lance. I mean, big time. Now, maybe that's subjective, and I haven't seen it much, and it may not be true. All that, you know, all those, I don't want to call them excuses, but call them uh, uh, recognition that my data set is limited. Um, but I've seen these Mark 48 slow down, dumbed down. I've seen twice now typhoons that just take ridiculous damage. And they go off 28 knots. And they're still hard to hear. You blow holes, even if they're double hulled, you blow holes, great gigantic mess on that outer hull and all the gear that they have stashed between the outer hull and the, uh, and the, the, the people tank. Uh, it's going to get a lot noisier as it moves through the water, especially at 28 knots. I mean, there's all kinds of things going on there. Back up. It's just a game. Boss, it's just a game. And I'm not going to quit. This is interesting. I want to keep finding out more. But I really, I really wonder if we just aren't seeing the other side. And you know what the answer might be? The answer might be play a Russian scenario and see just how hard it is to uh, perform with a Russian submarine. Hmm. I don't know. I'm not complaining. All right. I'm, I'm trying to evaluate. I'm having fun. It's crazy different. And I don't know what to make of it. But right now, I, 
I'm just glad that I still have my vanilla installation. All right, you can you can have two installations on your machine. I think I described that once. Copy your Steam. I have a Steam folder, but basically duplicate your existing uh, Cold Waters folder, mod that, put a new shortcut to the duplicated EXE, and you can do this. And, and you can have your old and your new, and everything works. Um, Okay, well, I'm making a long video even longer. So what do you say we call it? And please, hey, in the comments, let me know what you think. Because uh, I am somewhat amazed. In any case, hey, I appreciate you watching. And I'll see you again real soon. Hey, thanks for watching. If you click on that picture of Very Young Waz, you'll be subscribed so you'll never miss another video. Then click on that bell notification button. And please share and comment. See you again soon.